do I invite you? Am I just blind? Oh no, I'm under solo. That's the problem. Figured it out. You're solo player. Yep. All right, so, so we're live again. Uh, I'm here with uh, Bat Pixie. We're gonna What's play some. What's up, guys? We're gonna play some Orcs Must Die too. Uh, pretty excited. Or Orcs Must Die three. I don't know why I said two. I'm just uh, losing my mind. What's yeah, you going got on? Some of that nostalgia in there. Yeah, for a game I didn't really play. Not much is going on with uh, me. How about you, man? Uh, not too much actually. I've actually been waiting the whole day just to play some more Orcs Must Die three. Uh, it's a game I really enjoyed last year when I first played it on Stadia, and you know it kind of blew me away how much fun this game can be because it's really the first time I've ever played a tower. Of is this a tower defense kind of game? You know, like uh, it, kind of. It, it's got like the same ideas as a tower defense game, right? You're placing towers, sort of. It's just more three D. Yeah, that's what it's. It's like <laughs> it's not tower defense like mobile, yeah. but it allows you to play as a character, and I think that kind of surprised me because I've never played a game like this before, and so when I was playing it, I was kind of like hit with how much fun this t genre is, and I'm not used to it. And I think we were talking about this last week that uh, a game like Gears Gears of War has those horde modes and it acts in a similar manner, you know, you have to defend yourself from waves of enemies and there's something about that that is just so much of fun. I think it must be psychological with us humans or something. Mm -hmm. Did you get my invite? Uh, no, I did not. No? Because I sent it to you. Okay, I'll cancel and I'll send it again. Just resend one. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Yeah, and also you're listed as Genshin Impact. Is it still? I swear to God, I changed it. <laughs> that's okay. Oh, I got like I've mind. changed it literally twice. I don't know what's wrong with this. I think the Genshin is too too powerful. It will not allow you to go to another game. Yeah, so I sent you the invite. You joined. Awesome. Uh, yeah, so I see and I am ready. All right. So this is Cliffside, right? Yeah, the eighth map or whatever. All right. I'm going to just check to see if you're still listed, Genshin. It shouldn't be because I, I changed it again. And given that this is the... Uh... I'm still seeing Genshin. Seriously. Guys, this is this is really Orcs Must Die 3. Um, no, I... What we... It might just be delayed. Okay. Um, Cause I let's don't... just break it down for some folks like watching. Like, we really wanted to showcase this game that it's still a really fun game uh, on Stadia. It came out one year ago, and a lot of people are now only discovering it because of what do you call it? It's on PC and Xbox, but this game still works really well. Like, honestly, Stadia might even be like a better place to play it, because like. <laughs> I think somebody was pointing out that if you like 80 or 90 percent of pc players will not be able to play these games in like good enough settings yeah it was like some weird crazy statistics that was revealed because of steam's uh, um steam has like all this data on people right mm -hmm. and they showcase that uh, do you want to put a box like right over here yep. man? perfect all right let's get this on I'm ready when you are. Uh, well, we should probably place something over here too, right? Uh, okay. At least some kind of defense, unless we just want to shoot things this round. Where are you? The opening round should be good, right? Yeah, it should be fine. Uh, but I see what you mean. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I know exactly what you mean. <laughs> All right, I'll put this right over here. It just says like an emergency. Sure, sounds good. Okay, it says Orcs Must Die 3 now, so it should be good. What are you playing with? Uh, I don't know. I have a bunch of different weapons equipped. Uh, no, like, oh, shoot. It's freaking trolls, dude. Or do you mean, like, mouse and keyboard? No, no, no. I mean, like, what, what's your weapon that you're using? Because I can't see you on the ground, so you must be using, like, a, a bone arrow or something? What yeah, I mean, I have the blunderbuss. I was using the bow for a second, and I also have the weird uh, 
like ice weapon. Okay. So equipped. which one did you pick? I mean, I have multiple equipped for no uh -oh. particular reason. Dude, what about the traps? The traps are up at the top. I thought you said we were fine. <laughs> well, I mean, like... And I had no money, so... For now, we're fine. I hope you're ready for this. What level are we playing on? <laughs> the normal difficulty. Dude, you gotta come down and... Yeah, do I'm really compare. excited for uh, Ark to come to Stadia, because... My PC that I use is a bit of a questionable at times, even running things just like Genshin Impact or like reasonable settings Minecraft. <laughs> so having the ability to play Ark like that is going to be super cool. Wait, Ark's coming? Yeah. Nice. Did you not hear about that? I heard about something, but I've never actually played Ark before. Oh, yeah. I knew somebody was trying to get like this dinosaur game in, but I didn't hear too much after that. Um, have you ever played Ark before? Um, I might have played it for like 10 minutes a long time ago, but it doesn't, like I said, doesn't run very well on my uh, PC. What kind, so. of, what kind of game is it? Is it a shooter? Uh, do you know like what kind of like Rust is? I watched Mr. Wobbles play Rust. He does a lot of singing in it. <laughs> it's... Oh, dude, I'm gonna die here, so you gotta come and deal with these guys. Gee, stop dying so much. Well, I'm down there on the front lines like Achilles. Uh, do you need help? Did he get past you? No, I killed him. Nice. It's kind of like rust but with dinosaurs i guess it's like that style of game where like you can build things um you can like tame dinosaurs tame dinosaurs you can like breed them together too to make okay. like super dinosaurs <laughs> oh snap I honestly i don't know cool. how he didn't hear about uh rust coming to stadia i'm pretty surprised i figured he would have heard I think you mean Ark. Or Ark, sorry, yeah. I did mean Ark. Yeah. Um, Minecraft with dinosaurs is another good way to describe it. Can you move your... Um, these ones here a little bit closer to the front? Perfect! Like, right over here. Like, put it, like, right in the front. Well, I only have one now, but that's fine. Yeah. And then... Can you put some floor traps? Sure. And then I'm going to clean up this area right over here, because it's pretty ugly. Okay. Yeah. Um, the only problem with saying it's Minecraft, but with dinosaurs, is uh, Bat Pixie has not actually played Minecraft as far as I know. <laughs> yeah. Which is honestly uh, kind of impressive. Oh, I think we should move these barricades over here back a bit, because they're coming through the side doors now, right? What do you mean the side doors? Just well, the ones right in front of us. No, no. They're coming directly to us. I mean, there's... Are you not looking at the map? There's like a whole other side over here. So you need to move your barricade. Oh, snap. Okay, okay, so hold up. This is what we need to do. Just, just put a block over here. You can just put it up here. It's... Oh. I am you pretty excited, want... though, for Ark to yeah. come. Because I know one of my friends plays Ark with his PC. And uh, even though I don't necessarily want to play with him because, you know, it's it's not necessarily the type of game you want to always be playing with friends, especially with friends you might feel tempted to do mean things to. Wait, what? <laughs> so, um, you know how in Rust you can, like, k kill people, take their stuff, uh, break their stuff? You can obviously yeah. do the same stuff in Ark. And sometimes, you know, you just want to troll your friends. And... But, like, aren't you guys on a team? Like, you have, like, your own civilization going on? No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, uh, you gotta build... Come come down to the barricades. I mean... We have so many traps. It's not like the traps are gonna do nothing. Yeah, there's an ogre. Or a troll or whatever. An ogre and troll. And these traps aren't enough. That's fine. They're getting through. They got through. One of them got through. 
More coming. Fight, fight to the last. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. It's just kind of calling out everything that's going on all the time. Who's in chat right now? Is a gamer? No, all purposes in chat. Oh, snack. The one. The old. The all purpose the old champ. Purpose the cowboy. <laughs> and now your mama knows. And now your mama knows. The king of content. <laughs> Did I die? One made it through. You might have died. No, no, no. So apparently my character has this ability to, to fall through, asleep. Well. I can't sell your trap. My trap? This one. Thing. Yeah, we have to wait till the next round. Oh, okay. So the wave's not over. Oh, there's two left. Yeah. So I'll go kill these guys. Sell it immediately. Um, yeah. And let's sell uh, this one. And... Can you put a barricade across here? Uh, let's get some kill kill stuff in first. purpose have you played this game before wait Connor are you still there yeah I'm still there oh <laughs> Thanks for the follow, uh, Ryzak. Yeah, so I don't know if you guys can, can can everyone hear me in the chat? Are they able to hear me? We had a little bit of issues earlier on. I, th I think so. Um, yeah, the one reason Thanks why, for the welcome. why we were interested in like showcasing this particular game as well. Um, was because the game just came out on PC and consoles and you know a lot more people are interested in it So by just playing it You know people who are on Twitch or whatever will see like you know oh, You can't hear bad pixie at all, huh? Okay, I'll try and fix it cuz I think Bad pixie's doing a lot of talking <laughs> Yeah Okay, just a sec Close the music. Can you try saying something? Yeah, so can everyone hear me now? Can they hear me? Can you guys hear him now? Because I can see it going through my uh, OBS. I hope they can hear me. I'm very sad if they can't. Uh, he was just being sarcastic. That's fine, too. What do you mean? Hey, thanks for the follow. He, he was uh, not being serious. He can hear you. Oh, what the? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to turn the music up for this, though, because I turned it way down for the uh, yeah. intro. Thanks for the welcome, man. Now I have the Lord, Lord Gaming Man and the uh, Master Gamer following me, so the clearly that gamer. should uh, say something about my amazing gaming wow. skills. <laughs> I would say so. They never followed me. And I've been here since day one. So I think I think they they like the honor. I'm at a lot of people. Glad to be liked. I don't know, sometimes I question that. I think it's because you know uh, all purpose. If you know all purpose then a lot of people know you. Uh, there you go. Yes, yeah, sometimes I think I'm likable, and then I uh, played Pokemon Unite recently, and uh, let me tell you, sometimes I say some not so likable things to myself. Yo, try and run up in the front of you and take a look at how many people are coming at you. I'll let you deal with them. Bye bye. Where are the 
other side? Or? No, no, no. Because I can see them all like coming into our little kill zone. And there are a lot of them. We need to fix up a barricade on the next uh, Did you know like there's a little patch right over here at the top where you can drop a bomb? Oh yeah I did. Um because I think I saw them, but I don't know, don't really need them. Yeah, let's so we fixed the barricades are fixed. Um we need another barricade here if we can, so that we can like extend this a little bit. Yeah, let's do that. I've got yeah, I, the thing, I, guys. I turned the game music down a bit. I had turned it up too much, I think, and it should be okay now. Hey, Dr. Sense. Is that Dr. Spaceman? It seems like a ton of people have uh, showed up from the Stadia Bash community network, so <laughs> glad to have you guys here. Uh, it's Jeff Gignac has also yeah. showed up, so thanks uh, for coming. Jeff. <laughs> it's like a, I think this is like the first time, correct me if I'm wrong, that folks from the Stadia Bash Community Network have come to watch somebody on Twitch. Uh, I could, I couldn't tell you. You'd have to ask. Uh, uh, Dr. Sen says Dr. Spaceman is another person. Uh, I have to take a look. I don't have the Twitch open right now, but I'm ready when you are, Connor. Uh, yeah, I'm ready to go. Yeah, let's go. Come Apparently, on, it sounds it. perfect now. So, More all right, guys, we finally have good. Hold the line. <laughs> Check out the skill. I can stand. I can fall to sleep like right here. Oh really? And never even know. Like right here. Isn't that basically the pain death thing? It is. <laughs> so you're that guy then? Yeah, I'm. Um, what's this? <laughs> yeah. When more of them come, we'll, we'll, I'll show it to you guys. So there are apparently a few people who stream on Twitch regularly. Um, yeah. I, I do know Jeff. Gig, Jeff is uh, from Team JMG. Uh, <laughs> I know we've talked a lot about that on uh, these Stinger streams. So. You go, blow them up. <laughs> you know, since Jeff is here, and I think there's a couple of other people from Team JMG, um, something that was quite interesting within the B game league, which was the the esports league that we were playing in, was a lot of folks who didn't know anything about Stadia. They didn't know anything about like cloud gaming. When they heard about Team JMG and the Stingers. They actually became really interested in like who we were, what we were playing, and a lot of folks, you know, they reached out and they're like, we bought the game on Stadia, we got Stadia just because we heard about it from you guys. And I'm kind of wondering if like, you know, like when we talk about why don't people know about this, how do people not know, I wonder if it's just, they don't have like any interaction with anybody who even uses Stadia. So, yeah, this one could yeah. be part of it. I also feel like there aren't a lot of, uh, like, I mean, there are a lot of, like, content creators about Stadia, but most of, like, the super huge content creators play, like, or are, like, just chatting and stuff like that. Just chatting? Yeah, like, uh, or, like, variety streamers, and they don't really use a specific platform. And I wonder if like Google could do a better job of reaching out to them and being like, hey, you know, maybe you play our Stadia exclusive game. More enemies and like, if you get the word about Stadia out and show how well it works, because it works amazingly, right? Like, I have been nothing but impressed when I have been using Stadia. And you're like more of a PC PlayStation gamer, right? Like before you start using it? Yeah. 
I mostly play games on uh, PC or like I used to play a lot of like PlayStation, Xbox games. You know, talking about like big streamers, there's another guy. He's named Sunny, Sunny Cloud Gaming. Mm -hmm. um, so when he started off, he was just a PC gamer, and he was like super skeptical about Stadia, like really skeptical about cloud Tell gaming. And okay, one of his friends, Ace, Ace runs. Um, what is it? Um, Howdy with the chance of meatballs or something. Um, <laughs> I that would be a great it. name for a cloud gaming account. <laughs> yeah, I can't remember what his That's actual um, YouTube and his, his website and stuff now. But he like he told Sunny about Stadia and There's together they started way. streaming um, Stadia content. And that's no actually way. how Sunny got really into it. And now he's the number one or the largest Stadia uh, content creator. He has over like 20,000 subscribers. Wow, that's pretty crazy. I will say the Stadia community is like one of the nicest communities on the uh not happening. just in general <laughs> I need a bigger challenge. oh my god uh, I think Jeff said he's gonna message you not on so uh, discord Cloudy with a Chance of Games. That's a really excellent name. Yes, uh, Cloudy with a Chance of Games. I knew there's something to do with that, like, movie. Yeah. The Meeple one. Dr. Sense also said they tried with the beta to get, um, like, larger content creators to play, and they just all quit, so. Yeah, you know, like, what's really fascinating, like, with all of us, like, I think pretty much everyone in chat at some point creates content of for Stadia. Mm -hmm. I could be wrong about that, but I, I feel like this platform really, like even for myself, I wasn't a streamer until I got to Stadia because it made uh, streaming so much easier um, just for me. But we are like that generation that will grow up now and be like content creators. And you can see everyone has been growing their user base, like not just user base, but like um, the audience behind it has been growing continuously um, so it's really exciting to be like this is like a new generation beginning thanks for the follow Dr. Sense yeah and I think like a another really nice thing about this is you don't like streaming has this like idea a lot of people have where you like need to have like a good PC right because you need to be able to play the game uh, you need to be able to run o like the OBS software and like whatever else you have going on. But this like just <laughs> totally takes like that out of a whole part of that out of the equation. It makes it so much easier to run pretty much everything, which is really nice. And also, it doesn't use a lot of resources on your GPU. Right. No, that, that's exactly the point, right? It takes yeah. out the uh, whole PC issue. PC issues, yeah, which is great. Are you upgrading? Yeah. <laughs> all purpose says, uh, nicest until you find out how we all want to kill each other, or maybe everyone wants just <laughs> just wants to kill him. Uh, you know, I've heard you talk a lot of trash, so <laughs> <laughs> you know. I think that's part of the fun of it, though. Oh, of course. Like, Friendly like banter rapping, is right? always super important in like. It's a like community. I've been watching a lot of um, rapping, just because of Harry Mack. And it's like, that's just part of the culture. People have fun with it. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're... Master Cygnus and Lorwick would fight one more battle together before the Many end. years back in time again. You understand, this is probably my favorite map in the entire game. single-minded stubbornness into obedience. Yeah, I'm gonna put it on YouTube. Uh... Any control would be temporary. See the orcs for what Did you tell them why you couldn't do it on YouTube? Oh, no, no, I, I just said... Uh, I told all purpose why, because it was because I didn't activate it in time to. Uh... If that is truly your goal, look to the defense of this rift. Not have yeah. to wait 24 hours. Um, so what's gonna happen is I'm gonna barricade the right side. Okay. And then um, 
We'll just defend on the left side. Sure. But just so I have archers it. now. Where should I put my uh, giant turret thing? We're gonna be on the on the left side. Sure. I just randomly came through the uh, gate. So. So I could probably just put it here, right? Where are you? Do, do you see my turret? Uh, I think so. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna start like building up over here, just to like hold them back. Sure. And I'll put like a big tree in the front here. Uh, I got knocked down, but I'll get back up again. It's Remember just why you get blocked. Fair. Yeah. Seriously, thank you for uh, like tweeting all this stuff. It's I love this device. Very. Uh, very nice that you are so accommodating of my uh, personal failings. <laughs> Yo, I think we're gonna get steamrolled over here. I placed some archers down the other side, so hopefully we'll be fine. Okay. And we've got my nice giant siege weapon, so. I'm gonna switch up some of my um, defenses that are probably going to be absolutely useless. Um, okay. So, <laughs> because there's some useless things that I have over here. Like ceiling stuff, probably going to be useless. Yeah, probably. <laughs> uh, so, I have also never seen this level before. This is actually the second time only that I'm playing this game. Um, both times with uh, Bat Pixie. Okay. Let's do this. We've got some warriors here to help us out, Connor. Oh, oh snap! Can you move your turret Get thing back. over here? Over where? Archers, Can you pull ready. pull your turret from there? And put it where? I'll show you. Where are you? Like over here, so you have like a line of sight on these guys. Uh, sh sure, I, I guess. I mean, I had a good line of sight the other way. Trust me, we're gonna have. They're gonna just steamroll past us. Yeah, I'll just come put um, it down here in the corner, I guess, yeah. and then I can just fire straight down. Yeah. A master's All right. machine. Um, yeah, Bat Pixie definitely should uh, join the Stadia Bash community network. He creates content a lot, anyways. Uh, thanks for following, Jeff. Especially those great audio reviews, man. They're just <laughs> <laughs> what? so Dude, you insane. Keep saying that. I st here's the thing, guys. I don't think anyone knows this, but I used to make a lot more tech videos, um, and that's what I thought like was gonna happen. I thought I was gonna be like, you know, do tech videos. I got like over a hundred thousand views on my Sony headphone reviews. Did a couple more, you know, a couple ten thousand videos. Then I discovered Stadia, and I just got so interested in this whole platform um, that I kind of felt like that's what I wanted to make videos on. And then I just like dropped the whole tech piece because I was having way more fun talking about like Stadia and games. And I think that's when I first started getting on the radar of like, you know, all purpose, like when we first connected. This was like two years ago. And now it's like, I don't really feel like talking about like audio reviews and stuff as much as like like what we're doing right now. So, <laughs> my audio reviews, they have been great, but right now they're not that great. Yeah. Alright, the horde's coming, Connor. Yeah, I've been shooting down there the whole time. I really think no, my no. other place was better. The horde is coming now, they haven't gotten you.
I do think that like the SBCN, just like it is free advertising for the channel, but I also think it's like really good for the Stadia community to have things like this. Because like if nobody else is gonna do it. then the community has to do it, and the hallmark of a good community is people being willing to do it. Gaming gamer man says make us all mods look forward to attack the ever. That actually kind of sounds pretty good. I will probably start modding some people soon. Uh, if you guys want to be mods. I wonder if you're just playing a like a wordplay because there's trolls attacking you now. Oh, it, it, is it that or is it because I'm also the slayer of trolls? Oh yeah, that is true. <laughs> I completely forgot about that. Right now my only mod is uh, Bat Pixie, and he's been a bit remiss in his duties. Wait, I'm a mod? I told you, you knew you were a mod. You banned uh, Matthew the other day, <laughs> or like the oh, other week. right! <laughs> I gave him a 30 se I had to give this guy a 30 second you know, time off guys. He was saying too many nice <laughs> things about me. <laughs> I, I don't think he was even saying anything. I think he just wanted to abuse your power. <laughs> I want you to fight hard. As some of you guys know, I was banned for life from the Xbox subreddit. <laughs> so... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, true. That actually happened. So, <laughs> I wanted to see what it's like to be a power hungry mod. Well, I figured you were just going to say that you're super toxic. <laughs> uh, trolls can be fun if they're... Uh, not like the like extreme kind of trolls. An easy but... victory. <laughs> All right, where do you want to move your stuff? Uh, oh, I don't know. Maybe we can add more archers somewhere. And th like, th thanks for to... saying that I'm too nice of a guy for trolls. But as I was saying earlier, uh, My oh, pride is while I have never been chat restricted oh. in any MOBA game. Well again. Uh, I can tell you for a fact that uh, some of the things I want to say to people in those games sometime are not very nice. Like, I, I've been playing a lot of Pokemon Unite because it's uh, pretty fun, very simple MOBA. I think everything I have is pretty much fine. We can try and, like, oh, oops, make a pathway or something somewhere. Oh, snap! Um, I return at your hour of Are you going to move your turret? No, I think it's fine. Okay. What I can do is I can put like these um these guards over here for you. Sure. Yeah, I don't really want my chat to be uh <laughs> or like comments to be overly moderated. I think like Unless someone is, like, actually harassing someone, it's pretty much fine. Are you ready? Or do we need to place, like, anything else? Because, like, it seems like we're doing fine. Yeah, I think this is okay. Come up here and take a... Like, did you ever want to see all these guys rush at you at once? More enemies on the way! Maybe. Maybe I'll do that in the next wave. There's another wave, right? When all the bosses come? Yeah. Man, it's so epic. I kind of wish, like, these guys actually took advantage of Stadia's multi-compute capabilities. Because then they could have, like, double this just coming at once. Oh, it would be amazing. Yeah, if you could have, like, twice this amount of people, that would be, like, really sick. But I guess they knew in, the, in their mind that they wanted this to be, um on console and PC and all of that, so they, they had to limit themselves. Uh, 
What is Grime? I feel like I've heard of that game, but might not have. If you could uh, describe it to me. Honestly, being a bit new to the whole Stadia thing, I was... Oh, I guess Sunday is August 1st, isn't it? I haven't actually looked at any new pro games. But I will take a look, uh, and I will let you know what I think of them. Or you can tell me what they are, and I will uh, gladly react. Crazy to me that it's almost August. Well, well, well. Those Where did the CO go? Like? Could pose a Where does all yes. time go? It's Remember just to like. Fight them far from any barricades. On purpose, they didn't even announce the beans coming for Sunday. Did I miss something? I think there was like a leak. I know there's a PlayStation leak. There's enemy at the gates. Can you go to the gate? Enemy at the gate. I know. The hot spot's coming. A 2D side scroller where you have special powers. I do like 2D side scrollers. I think they're really fun. Uh. I don't remember the name of the uh, game that I used to play that was like a 2D side scroller. It was like an indie Steam game. But. They tell you on the last. Uh, the Tuesday. Makes sense, I guess. Which are my hoods? I don't know what yours is. I love this device. Yeah, I got it. Alright. So okay, I guess they'll announce that tomorrow then. I want to try something different, Sophia. You might have to move your guy. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna. Ah, <laughs> uh, do I have any guesses? Um. Not really. Um, so what do you want to do? I want to put these boulders at the top. Okay. And an archer right at the top. Or you can put your thing. Can you put your 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 thing on top up there? Yep. This will surprise. Does it work? <laughs> yeah. That's probably a good spot. It's got a good vantage point. Alright, and I'm gonna throw some, uh, one of these guys over here, just to, like, trap everybody. Maybe after being on sale for the last, like, two months that I've seen, they'll put, uh, the Dragon Ball Xenoverse game on, uh... Can you come down and put up, like, a barrier right over here? I don't have enough money for the barrier. Um... <laughs> uh, okay, I have nothing, so this has to work. Yeah, it'll be fine, we got this. So... Let's see. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> Alright, we'll unleash the horde. Here we go, guys. Let's do this. More enemies on the way! So, I think All Purpose wants to take a guess at like what games are coming. Yeah. I... Yeah, I think... Oh, if Ark is supposed to come during the summer, I would guess that Ark for sure would be one of them. And that would be a pretty hype announcement, right? Like... Yeah, it's, it's a game that should have been here by now. Um... And August is like, well, technically not the last month of the summer. Definitely feels like the last time we've seen it. Oh, 
go do on a move. Get them. I would like to see a lot of uh, indie games come to Stadium Pro, especially with the new monetization. Uh... Ideas. Or like, what's the word? Setup. Because I think that, that'll be really good for indie studios. Why are you going in the wrong direction? All purpose, what do you think is coming? Grime could be a pro game. Could I be. Think that, I think that that is the type of game that would work pretty well for um, a developer like Grime. Yeah. I think they're coming to Game Pass, so they should be open to this. One game I think might actually come to pro. I don't know if it will be now or later, but I think Killer Queen Black. I think. I think this yeah, would be a game that, that actually would make a lot of sense. Um, I think it would be good for them too. Like. It's a game that's really easy to get sucked into. And since they're now paying like by like play days, right? Or like days of play. Yeah. Uh, I think it'll really work well for a game like that. Oh, you put some uh, fire traps down. Just let those guys that run really fast get over there. Put some slow but if you want, if you actually want, why don't you just uh, do this? Um, we'll remove these. That was fine. Put a barrier over here, and they'll have to come through one area. Sure. Perhaps one of these. Okay. There we go. Go one of these here. Uh, what is something cool that we could throw in? I think it would be really cool if, like, uh, some roguelike games came to Stadia too, and were like released as pro games. Maybe something. I don't really know what, but <laughs> I haven't done a good job of looking through the whole Stadia library. We're pretty well set up to take this wave. Yeah, this is wave four out of five, so I think we're one away from the boss level. Mm -hmm. More enemies I'm kind of curious to see what How's it going? Feels. Yeah, this is a good bump. It's a really good aim because you get like to shoot right down into them because they're kind of moving. Since any. Since everyone can only see you playing, why don't you go down over there and uh, take a look and I'll fire from up here. Sh sure, where am I going? Like, like, go in. Like, right up to the full, uh, wave. There's a lot of people coming. And a lot of arrows getting shot. Man, this crossbow thing is so crazy. Right, it's so cool. But it's a different experience when you're at the bottom, right? Yeah, very much so. You can be... Oh, shoot, you're not using the... the balls. What, sorry? The little balls that we put on that one. Do you remember? Yeah, Under yeah. The tower? it's super cool <laughs> watching the... Uh, <laughs> crossbow shoot the arrows out. 
if you shoot those bolts with your gun, they will come off. These? Oh, I have to shoot them. Or you fifth one. And see if you can pick up some of those blue things, those blue lights there. Because those are the scoops, right? No, that actually gives you more money to buy new packs. Okay. Like a, a, a big game, and I kind of wonder, like, based on everything we saw at the Stadia keynote, if they're hoping to make like gaming season in September, October, the big, like, second wave of Stadia. Like, they're gonna have way more games on Stadia Pro, they're gonna transform it into a Game Pass kind of thing, based on everything they've been saying. Um, so, a lot of interesting things to, to see coming. Yeah, I think that when art comes out, uh, I don't know how they're gonna do it, if, but we should definitely all play some arc and uh, ruin some people's days. <laughs> some negative gaming experiences for other people. Can you put like a random trap like where I am? Like a, no, like a random box. Like a barricade? Like a barricade, like a random one. Like right here. Sure, that's fine. Sure. No better spot than here. Hey, I'm ready when you are. Do you have a switch or no? Do you have like a Nintendo Switch? Me? Yeah, you. No, no. No. So you haven't yet experienced uh, Pokemon Unite? <laughs> I have no idea what that is, but I've heard people say it's like amazing. Yeah, so it's uh, the Pokemon MOBA. And I thought that League players tilted me until I played this game. I get. These people just like belligerently grief you. And it's very annoying. What do you mean? Like, why? What kind of game is it? Isn't it just Pokemon? So it's a MOBA game, right? Like a like League of Legends type game. Okay. That's unique. So the idea is there's like two lanes in a center area. And you go into the lanes, you go into the center area, you get points, and then you score goals in like... the opposing team's uh, nets, basically. And it's a really okay. fun concept, a really fun game to play. The problem is that among the uh, player base are too many people who uh, really enjoy not saying that they're going to go into the central area and then taking all of the Pokemon like camps in the central area, and it's very frustrating. Oh, snap. Uh, whenever you're ready, Connor. Sure. Oh, I thought All you were going right. to shoot and I was going to look at the uh, massive amount of people that... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, I was just waiting for you. No, I suicided myself. Remember me? Uh, snap. He's coming. Stupid indeed, but we will and we are out of position. Yeah. Oh, he's going to destroy the barricades? Oh. Yeah, so I'm well, I'm really worried if he goes right. You have to stop him from going right. No, he's going to the left, it looks. Did he pull for our trap? Oh, he hears me. He's coming to you, so I'm going to start shooting him with my... Uh... Holy, there are a lot of uh, enemies. That's not possible. Mana is nearly gone. That won't be the last. Four bosses down. 
Nice. Guys as well. Yeah, I see. I hit him with the bees. With what? With the bees. There's like the bee tree. Oh, right. So the B the B uh, I think that just makes them confused, right? Oh, I don't know. It does something like that. If you get the track, they can the B stop causing them. Regardless of what it does, it uh, stops them from advancing, so... There's still more. It's crazy. You should get these guys. I think you can do it. Well, there's like I wonder tons of them. I wonder if there's a problem. Man, look at all we nice. yeah. We're too good at this I game. I think Legolas would be proud of us. <laughs> right? Yeah. I think it would be really cool to have like a more like pitched battle version of this game, if that makes any sense. Oh, we got five, five skulls. What do you mean a pitch battle? Uh, so like, the pitch battle is not quite the right thing, but more like a siege, right? Where you have like high walls around like an area. I think that would be cool. You know that first war map? That was a siege. Kind of, but it doesn't feel quite the same because it's like they're all going to like this side path. Yeah. Whereas, like, I think it would be cool if they were all just kind of running at the wall. Well, it's good that you say that because they actually might be one of those maps or a couple of those maps. Nice. That will be. Very <laughs> but exciting. I wonder. I wonder if we see that soon. Probably, um, if there are th things that exist. Yeah, there's some interesting maps that come up. Like, for the most part, these ones are all like simple, but it gets a little bit interesting later. This was that's why I think this was my favorite one. I think this is my favorite one because it's easy and it's very relaxing to do when you just listen to a podcast. <laughs> Fair. Slaps enemies in the face and throws them back. Spike wall. Yeah. So we are coming up to the end of the like hour that we would regularly be regularly be uh, ending, I guess, if someone is going after us in the Stadia Bash community network. So, uh, what was the point of that but I've been again? told that uh, because no one's going after us, we can keep streaming. So they haven't been seen since the days of so Master Cygnus and Vorwick, and now. So maybe back. what we could do is we can start blocking off areas. Yeah, we gotta to create armies, not figure out where to block. We've got this, sorceress. Let's trap it up. So I guess they all. Oh, is some going through the portal? How are they getting up here? Oh, I see where the other stairway is. So we should just block off one stairway, right? Yeah. What we could actually do, like right here, is we could like literally just block this part right here. Like that. And they would be forced to go all the way around. Well, couldn't we just block like right like further back and just block the stairway? Uh, I mean, we could block one of the stairways, yeah. And then they'd still be forced to go all the way around. But I'm just saying, like, in preparation for, like, the next ones that come. So we don't have to keep doing this. Well, will we have to keep doing it? Yeah, because they're going to come through this door, that door, all these doors. So we can have them, like, go around this whole bottom area. Right, and but if there's up. only one, uh, 
stairway they can go up, then they can only come from one spot at the top. Because there's only two stairways. Yeah, but what I mean is, like, do you have a lot of, like, um, wall traps and stuff? I have a few, I guess. So if you want to, like, use them, you need, like, walls, right? Yeah, well, there's walls up here. Okay. Uh, all right. You tell me where to go, and I'll go. Block the stairway. There we can we always go. add uh, more barricades down here to make them go, like, different directions, but... I think even as is, they're going to have to go uh, around quite a ways. Just put your barricade like right next to you. Okay. Because that should block it. It's blocked. Put a nice seat. Perfect right up placement. Here. It. Put some wall traps, or one wall trap, because I have no no money left. Yeah, you we should get some stuff in here. Good to go. Um, I'm thinking of like, how, what should we place here? Uh, well, at some point we should probably end up putting barricades down here to like make them go in like a circle type thing but for now I think we can just probably okay I think I'll just put some top uh, okay can't wait let's do it What's like your dream game to come to stadium? Enemies are preparing to breach one of our gates. They've which game? broken through like, a gate. Which game out of all games would you like to see come to stadium? Here they come. That's a good question. Um What is one game that I would love? I feel like I know the answer to this. But it's Oh, I I know, I know it. Battlefield 5, a uh, Battlefield 2042. That, that game needs to be on stadium, man. Like, I don't know what they need to do, but that's a game that should be on stadium. And I think a lot of people would be interested in having it somewhere. There needs to be one place for it, because right now it's just on PC and next-gen consoles. And the current consoles, I don't think they're gonna... Like, you know, the PS5 and the... I mean, the PS4 and stuff, I don't think cut it out. Yeah, and that would be a great candidate for Stadia because it's probably going to be like very, very uh, heavy load about. on your PC. Oh, that yeah, that's going to be crazy load. Um, so it would so be yeah. really nice for people to be able to uh, run it without worrying about that, and Stadia does do that, so. Thanks for the compliment, man. I'm glad you enjoyed the stream. I've enjoyed doing it. I really like streaming. I think it's a lot of fun. Talking with random people in the chat and like all that stuff is something I really enjoy. Also, I talk to myself when I play games anyways, so <laughs> may as well let everyone else see my uh, ramblings. Yeah, I think for me the game right now that I want to most see on, like, want to see on Stadia the most is the uh, <laughs> Nickelodeon fighting game, <laughs> the one that's supposed to be like a Super Smash Bros. type game. Can you put some more traps over here, like not just the one? Yep. Or like ceiling like traps, or just whatever. Like something closer up here, because if they're gonna come through this one pathway, we need to like deal with them in this pathway. Well, they're gonna come through our little. Kill zone here, yeah. right? Exactly so we can just put where I want it. Like that. that should be okay. Ready to go. Uh yeah, like the Nickelodeon All Stars uh More Super Brawl or whatever. I'm genuinely surprised that's one of the Another games. door is being attacked. Really? I, I used to love when I was a lot younger. Um playing like Super Smash Bros. Melee and stuff like that. 
I was never very good at it, but I had a ton Yo. of fun. Are you seeing these guys? The Earth guys? Yeah. Yeah, we've fought them before. They were the last one too. They're I cool enemies. It's so cool that they like. I really like enemies that break apart like this. I think it's a good design. I think he's stronger. But yeah, the Nickelodeon fighting game is supposed to have like all of the, or like a lot of the Super Smash Bros. melee mechanics, like wave dashing. Canceling. Stuff like that. Shield drops supposed to be in it. Uh, so it's basically going to be each HD melee, is what I'm trying to say. And uh, as a huge fan of Super Smash Bros. Melee, I'm very excited for it. All purpose, what is your dream game? I, I'm, I'm not in the chat, so I can't even really see it. Uh, I don't think you actually said that was trivial. You're just saying that the new rule for the uh, Stadia Bash community network is that if no one's uh, directly after you, you can continue your stream past the hour. And uh, after us, there's no one until 10, so. More enemies on the oh, way! 10, god damn. Because I guess a lot of people are probably on the East Coast, right? And for East Coast people, that's like 1 a.m. Shoot, they're blowing up our barricades. Oh, shoot, look out for these dudes. Suicide bombers. We need to put a barricade over here quickly. Oh, they blew up the other one? Yeah, they blew up the main entrance. Okay, well, I'll have to go up then. Uh, shoot, they killed me. They're coming. They killed they're you? Swarming. Well, you're back, so that's fine. Here they come. They swarming through us. Just in the neck. Come on, you little rats. Oh shoot, ogre. Hey, I mean even if the ogre makes it through, it only counts as one, right? So. Yeah, let him go. Take up a little guy. Well, they don't tell you, right? No, of course. Watch this. I'm just saying, if they told us we would have a better plan. <laughs> I think that's part of the fun of it. No, of course. Know. There's so many enemies in this game, it's, it's crazy. Remember to throw it on traps if you have money. You should have a lot of money. Uh, I've thrown down some traps. Anyone got a bandage? Oh, I'm uh, dying. Just come stand in the room. Whoopsie! No, I just died. Okay, different plan this time. Textbook. Alright, well we did not lose. Okay, hey, you gotta coming, go get that barricade so. up. Yeah. And defend it from the, uh... More enemies that's not... You have to place both up here, I think. 
I don't have any money to place. Okay, two. we'll have placed another one. Oh, they're coming. The barricade is under attack. Deal with them. They destroyed a barricade on the other side. Yeah, I'll go deal on that side. Oh my goodness, our barricades are finished. But the traps are still over there, right? So they're not going to even go to the traps. It's an open. They won't even see the traps. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh god, you got to go back to the top. Go to the top. Yeah, I'm going. I'm at the top. We might have to respawn this. Oh, no, no, it'll be fine. Oh, I am good at this. Are they coming the other way? No, no, no. Oh, are they killing the barricades over there? Maybe. More okay. enemies in the rift. This is where we hold the line. survive this wave. We need to rethink our strategy. Well, what we need is one person to, uh... I am near death. Yeah, all those traps. Side. Oh, we're just gonna move all these traps? Yeah, clear those ones, because they, they're sitting on the wall doing nothing. Well, I was gonna say we could place the barricades back. We could also just not have barricades and just hope it's good enough. <laughs> we need barricades, man. No, no. I have oh. so many arrow walls over here, it'll be great. The optimal but we need spot. them to come up there first. Yeah, we have the barricades on the other side, so you go defend the barricades on the other side from the, uh, I the sapper traps. guys. I'll defend the barricades on this side from the sapper guys. <laughs> and I only have a couple barricades over here. Can you come over here for a second? Uh, one sec. I'm changing the They'll never see case. this one. Oh, you got rid of the barricades. Yeah, so I'm gonna place the barricade. Um, maybe like right over here. Okay. Uh, actually, no, hold on. No, that'll work. I want to kill these sapper dudes first before they can even get here. Uh, so, well, if I could just... Can, if you want to kill the sapper dudes, go place the traps at the bottom. We'll yeah, the I'm going to place one at the bottom there, but they can get through it. Yeah, I'm place Perfect a, a place dart, trap. Uh, dart trap needs a killing floor. It won't be useful there. I'll put my stuff over here. I, I really think it'll be fine there, but... I'll, I'll put a arrow trap behind it and there we go very well defended <laughs> we'll even place another arrow trap and then I'm gonna go uh, place some other traps and stuff over here Okay, I'm good to go. Yeah, now's the time. 
make sure to defend the barricades. Like, actually go stand by them. Yeah, but I want to help him put some stuff up for you as well. Oh, I'm fine. Like, I've got so much of cash. You can go put, like, a blade thing at the bottom if you want. <clears throat> like, look at this right over here. Um... You should go on the opposite side so you can take advantage of that. That's it. What do you mean? Nah. And See, because this way I can force them to come this. this way. See? Now you don't need this guy, this guy. These guys? No, I do, because the, uh, the explosive guys will come. I'm just gonna put this over here. Where they will here. Fall. Sure. Exactly where I want. Put another grinder. Put another long. Perhaps one of these. I'm stuck. Our wall traps are gonna be in order. No, it's fine. For optimal efficiency. We can just start. <laughs> you just want to go for it? Yeah, we got this. Just go defend the other one. Okay, you say No, so. why are you not over at the other one? Go to the other one. More I'm enemies going. on I'm the going. way! Oh, enemies oh, maybe there's no sap this front. round. Watch out! Because they're coming through the other gate. Here they come! This is how they get you. They make you think there's only a couple people. What do you mean? I think there's tons of people. Yeah, now the horse is coming. Ah, uh, the sappers are coming. Make sure to... Yeah, they took me out. I'd rather die than allow my barricades to die. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's uh... a... fair play, right? Yeah. Many times for a good cause. <laughs> this area is looking vulnerable. No, no. Just because so many of the big guys came. And they tank so much. Yeah. We need to slow them down. How do you know they're coming? They're the yellow ones. So you yeah, can see them like That's running. Coming. I see them. Don't kill me, Sapper. Uh, they're coming to me. Yes. I sacrificed myself for you. My phone help. Let's do that again. Power. Is coming. Not so tough now. Where are you going, huh? How do you know 
the name Sapo? Uh, I thought that's what it said over their heads, but maybe I'm wrong. Are you working tomorrow, Connor? No, I don't. Maybe at 9 o'clock then, you could do like a, or 9.30 or whatever, you can stream uh, what new games are coming to Stadium. Because they'll announce at 9. No, are they going to do like an actual it. announcement or like uh, Yeah, every Tuesday is the announcement. Yeah, but they, do they do like a live announcement or is it just like a... Pack, break the barrier, break the barrier. The one that's weak. Where? Oh, too late. Saf is coming. And there's tons of them. Boy, the the walls. God oh, damn, there's so many. They killed me. They killed you? Well, they're all coming this way, so. The defendant with your life. I lost one barricade, but that's fine. Yeah. I'm just running into them. Because I just replaced it. You need a ranged weapon to uh, deal with them. How could I do it? I have range weapons. Yeah, you can just I, shoot have, them. I have turrets. Oh, well, you should place them on the roof down there. That yeah. sappers come like at the beginning again, the turrets can shoot them. Now, though, there's just like a ton of overs. <coughs> I'll need more mana soon. Yeah, I'll stay down and just like slow them down. Like, Low the on mana? Not Do you work tomorrow? I uh, can't. I don't know. I don't think so. Gosh, come on, let's do this. No way. Good luck. How did you die? Uh, I'm just giving some more help. Okay. Yeah, if you're not working, we can both do it. Yeah, as long as you can speak the good. Right, because you're uh <laughs> my laptop has um, some problems. Some technical difficulties. What exactly happened? So, for some reason, the screen on the right hand side became like all pixelated and stuff. So, like long lines of different multicolors that just popped over the screen. So, it looks really, really bad, right? Like, you can't use a laptop. Like that. Yeah, of course. So, I contacted Amazon, but. Obviously, 30 days is up, so they can't replace it to anything. Right. And I think there's a warranty still. Um, so... Actually, no, there was no warranty. There's no warranty? Oh. Yeah, there wasn't the 90-day warranty from Amazon expired. So yeah, what there wasn't like a, a warranty with Asus. Yeah, so I think what Asus said was... Because they put me on a call with Asus, Amazon. Right. And they were like, well, we'll take a look at it. And they sent me the shipping information. So I shipped it, I went to FedEx right away, and you know, it's gonna be overnight shipping. So hopefully they get it by Tuesday or Wednesday. And then she said it will take about seven days for them to like you know, investigate, take a look at it. Right. Try and figure and, everything out. Yeah. We'll see what happens. That sucks. But I heard like it's not too difficult to replace the screen. Yeah. So hopefully they can we'll just do it. that. Well, That's assuming it, it's actually the screen. Right. Yeah, it definitely will be the screen. But everything else works. Like if I connect it to a monitor, it works. It works? Okay, yeah. It definitely is just the screen. That should be pretty easy. Well, that's good. There's no way. At least it's not like the graphics card or something dumb like that. No, I don't can't think it's the do it. But fortunately, I have a Chrome file, so I can still play Stadia. Yeah. <laughs> play on something. Yeah. Well, you can play Stadia on mobile too, right? Yeah, on my phone. So I, I would have still been able to play. Yeah. It's still a better experience. I mean, like, what I used to do though, before I had like Chrome files, um, you could actually just connect my Samsung to my monitor and use Samsung Dex. That right. Nice. Should be extra credit. So, that's what I used to do. Yeah, we're just too good at this. Oh, uh, we didn't get five stars.
five skulls. Go ten skulls. Yeah, that was a two see, bolt. We got two two stars. We're too good. <laughs> <laughs> that was a tough round. Yeah, we definitely got a bit uh, messed up by not figuring that stuff out. Yeah, it's a tough map as well. Yeah, for sure. Um, how many enemies were there? I mean, the game definitely gets harder as it goes on. I still don't have the uh, auto ballista for the ceiling, sadly. Yeah, it's one of the most useful things. Um, see, I should also be upgrading. Yeah, never mind. Sorceress, uh, that thing you said about how I was, you know, born with innate magical ability like Warwick? Okay. You don't remember your childhood? Curing your mother's fever, teleporting... Are there two levels, like three levels for this? Free. I remember. And yeah, stuff it's, kind of happened uh... when I was around. Just good timing and you know, luck, right? I'm still trying to figure no, out how they're gonna get you. Luck. Some of so they can come from below and they can come from above. For you, it just happened. Okay. We've no time for this now. You have work to do. I think. And then we have like these. Uh, I think the secret, the secret is to get them to all go through one passage area, like through this area right here. I think they have to end up going through one passage to get to the end, anyways. Like there's only one way actually through, and it's just straight down the middle. So what I'm saying is, can you like put a box like? Do you have double boxes that you can? No, I don't, don't even. Have okay, you know, don't even worry about the double box right now. One block, one box. Right there. Yeah, so they have to go through this spot right here. Right, so they have to go around. Um. And then we can place things there. But also we can place things ahead in case there are. Yeah, we could also put it on the sevens. walls and stuff. Could put things on the walls. That is true. All right. Well, I have no gold left, so. Woo! Okay. Let's do this. I guess later they can come up through this side. Enemies are preparing one. to breach one of our gates. They've no, broken through a gate. Go inside this portal. Here they come. Come inside the portal. So now the orbs are covered in armor? All that armor should make them pretty weak to lightning attacks. Lightning attacks. Well, that would have been a good thing to know. Maybe I would have brought some lightning attacks. Wait, do you use lightning attacks? No, the ogres are weak to lightning attacks. The armor ones are this. One of the four armored creatures are weak to them. Can you deal with that ogre downstairs? I can take them all I down. Armor. He's still down there with you. good spot because they don't have a direct uh, inquiry into this area. There are enemies in our rift room. We just yeah, have to defend it more. The problem, we'll is... The problem with saying that is that there's, there's the uh, stairs behind it too. Did they come up through that area? Yeah, they come up through here from the other gate, I think. Yeah, they will come here. That's why we have to do this. Look. And then place a barrier right here. So they have to go through one section only. Like this. No, like remove this one, place it at a diagonal. Place it at a diagonal. This will surprise no. them. Uh, 
Okay, hold on, hold like on. I have yeah, perfect. So, they now have to I have come nothing to, that. to place, so. It's all so, on you. what I was saying is, you don't have to do it like that because I can uh, contribute as well, right? Sure. Um, so. But it's the same idea. Yeah, the same idea. Okay, maybe what I'll do is I will just. Just place traps. Yeah. I'll stay at the top then. Okay. And remember to use those cauldrons as well. The cauldrons right. are really useful. Yeah. Okay. Off we go. And I think you have the ability to just shoot them. More enemies so it all works the way. way better. Where are the cauldrons are right there? They're all over the place. Like a cauldron uh. Watch out! Our enemies are broken through so again. So expect a ton of guys to come your way. Uh, they have a bunch of sappers too. You want the sappers first? Well, maybe they're just regular rat people. Nope, sappers. Yep. The nice thing is they just like blow up them, so it's fine. You need to go back to the top though, in case there's uh, sappers there. We have that portal, right? So the portal makes it easier. You could also like use the portal to get the game. Okay. Can you use your grenade? Your yeah. Okay. Easy. I feel weak. That guy's gonna take me out. Deal with him. Too heavily armored. Enemies at the rift. You got him. Bye bye. You don't have the chain like Ah, uh, uh, no, I'm just using uh, a blade stop. It, it heals me up whenever I'm too close. Okay. More enemies on the way! Come on, you little rat. You said you had a ranged weapon. <laughs> I don't have the ranged weapon now, but my ranged weapon was the, the crossbows at the top. Oh. Well, that's a trap. Yeah. <laughs> Good time. Oh, snap. Oh, no. These guys are flooding in here. Alright, I'm going to stop them. You deal with them. Fight caps go. Fighting damage. But it doesn't really help when uh, we can't really deal enough damage to them because I don't have any light defense. We'll be a lot better now since we can get into one area. Close one. So let's optimize now. Let's optimize our traps. I don't 
have a ton of the place. So what you remove, my uh Yeah, I'm opening up some areas here for you. And I'll put some spikes so that they get some chain lightning. Grindies. Or do you have the arrow wall? Where do you want the arrow wall? I don't have any arrow walls. Okay, doesn't matter. Um, totally ready. You see these sides over here? These grinders on the right hand side? Yep. Ooh. Surprisingly, we could just throw them in there. Here? Some of the weak enemies. Oh, yeah, that, that'll work. <sighs> How can we optimize this area? Uh, it's not really a good way. We can probably just go for it. Okay, let's try it out. Exactly where I want. Let's go, you maggots. Man, everyone has armor now. We got tons of ogres coming through the top, so we might want to hold the top. I mean, they're coming to the bottom now. Yep. Here they come. Yep. I'll use myself as bait. Move with uh, the cauldron right at the last minute. That was trivial. We're almost there. Not so tough now. Yep. There are enemies in our rift room. Up and bottom. Get the cauldron.
Oh, I'm gonna make this area here more viable for us. Since <laughs> clearly, um, what was going on over there was not too good. I mean, it was fine with the barrier. I don't know why you're moving it too far forward. It needs to be like here if you're trying to get them to go around. Okay. But I have no idea to put uh, any traps down there, so. Yeah, so let's optimize some of our traps here. Uh, this one? Well, I have a trap right down here, so. This one, this one. Can you put a, 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 what do you call it, two? I have no money. You have no money? No money. <laughs> what about now? Uh, nope, those are my traps. Those are yours. Okay. So you can go place whatever over there. The problem is, I don't have... <laughs> I don't have your stuff. Oh, well, what do you need? Uh, there you go. What do you want me to place? Okay. So you know how you have those archery walls? Yeah. Can you place an archery wall over here? Like right there. Yeah, perfect. Sure. And then one on. Can you place one on this side? Or put some things on the ground? That'll work. That's not a good place for it. But... I guess put like right here. Yeah, spike traps are awesome. I well, they're not traps. electric. Yours are electric, right? Um, Just like in training. I can place an arrow trap on this one. <laughs> Let's do this thing. As ready as I'll ever be. So. Perfection. Enemies on the way. All right, where are the sappers gonna come from? Huh. Nowhere right now. Low on mana. about to die, so good luck. Yeah. Hold that choke, please. There's no way. Holy cow, these guys are just Swimming in this area. Now. Yeah, they're all going through there. Right? So. Only the big guys. The little guys can't get through that wrong. More enemies Maybe in the rift. We need to come back here and like. We only have half our rift points remaining. Enemies at the rift. Stop them quickly. Yeah, we're just not doing a good job of killing the armor. Come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. You can take this guy down. Yeah. Yeah, we can get this, we can get this. Oh, I'm not saying we can. I'm just saying we're not going to get very many, uh... Perfect placement! Okay. This More enemies is where we on hold the way. Pretty well against uh, small enemies. Plus, 
Let's look at us uh, have more money so we can place more things. This is a good place to hold the line, actually. Yeah, because you can also keep backing up. So. I need to regenerate mana. Nope, can't do it. As long as there's not the uh, armor guys, it's easy. More enemies on the way. Yeah, I think so. Able to hold this line? Uh, maybe, kind of. Because I'm about to die. I just don't. Hey, I'm coming back. Can't cast without mana! Yeah, I think we got it. Nice. Can we go again? Close one, though. Yeah. <laughs> well, it was only close for some of them. I think it would have been got better if we had brought some uh, more electric uh, things, since they are weak to electricity. Yeah, I think electric is a good idea, but it's tough to... You have to upgrade all your weapons. Uh, well, there are some that just have electric right out, right? Which one? some kind of like electro ceiling thing or the wall charger it's a wall and it just outright does electric enemy damage oh uh, yeah i didn't i haven't unlocked but i didn't use it yet yeah well we unlocked it for this uh thing but i think i'm done for tonight so yeah that was a good stream i think yeah it was a lot of fun and happy to play with you uh, we'll go to my endings you were uh, I have a stream ending uh, scene that I usually put on my stream when I'm ending stream. Oh, nice. I'm going to watch it. Yeah, but it was a lot of fun. Happy to stream with you. Yeah. Uh, looking forward to doing it again. Definitely. When you join the uh, Stadia Bash <laughs> Community Network, uh, we can do it during your time, too. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> You're going to bring me into the Stadia Bash Community Network? Yeah, kicking and screaming if I have to. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. All right. Thanks but for yeah. inviting me over to the show. Well, you gotta. And, uh, since we're ending, you have to shout out your stuff. Um, yeah, guys. My name is Bat Pixie. Some of you may or may not know me. Uh, definitely check out my Twitch channel as well, Bat Pixie at Twitch, and as well as my YouTube channel, which is just Bat Pixie. I think some of you know me, so. You probably already subscribed, but if you don't know, uh, definitely go ahead and do that, because uh, I'll keep my eye out for you guys. Yeah, well, I'm also posting this on uh, YouTube, so if anyone's watching it there, uh, Bat Pixies, all the links will be in the description. Um, 
so make sure to check them out. Uh, if you're watching this on now on Twitch, or if you're watching it later in a VOD or whatever, uh, make sure to check me out on Twitter, twitter.com slash Slayer of Trolls. Uh, I'm on YouTube as well. There's a link on my um, on my Twitch, so consider checking me out there. Uh, and if you're watching on YouTube later, uh, make sure to check me out on Twitch, where I will mostly stream during the week. Uh, I'll be streaming on YouTube on Mondays, though. Um, Twitch.tv slash CLW22. Anyways, it's been a lot of fun. Uh, have a great night, everyone, and uh, talk to you all later. Bye. Bye. <laughs>